Hello, let me show you around the set. Here we are at Arts Depot North London and just before the preview audience comes in, let me see if there's a few Easter eggs you might like to see hidden on the set. This is a Heineken billboard that Sue did many years ago, which was actually owned by Jimmy Perry, the writer of Heidi High, and Sue got that from his estate fairly recently. This is a poster for Sue Pollard's first one-woman show. It was called A Song of Rock and a Tinkle. That was at the Donmar Warehouse. Now, there are a few more props hidden around here that we use in the show itself, including this fantastic fake Afghan fur coat and a bowler hat with a large feather in it. Sue was a bit of a hippie, and if you see the show, uh, they feature in a couple of the stories. Now, over on this side of the stage, a fantastic headpiece designed for Sue by the costume designers at the London Palladium. And then look, look at these three fantastic characters. This is Ivy Teasdale from Yurang Malord. This in the middle, Ethel Schumann from O Dr. Beeching. And of course, on the end, Peggy Ollerinshaw from Heidi High, three of Sue's most famous TV characters. A few more props sitting around, look, representing sort of touring and panto and that kind of thing. Uh, and then this is where our MD Steve sits. So this is his view of the evening. Uh, here we are in the little studio space where we're trying out the show at the moment. Now, it looks a bit different at night, as you can see, just before the audience comes in. Um, all the lights are off and uh, it all looks a bit more magical and out there really is dark. Um, and fingers crossed it goes well. There they are. Look, there's all of the people thoroughly enjoying a standing ovation for Sue at our first preview this evening. Don't forget, check out the website www.suepollardlive.com for all the tour dates for the rest of 2024 and for 2025.